I smell the same bunch of clothes on and it's still in my body or in your sense. It brings me back to my earliest memories of the years of my grandmother's house. For many different occasions, we would gather for Easter and Christmas. My family would use any excuse to gather my grandmother's and she was such an amazing cook. I find these meals have enriched my life and offered me many lessons. The memories of these meals offer me numerous notions of Without these holiday meals at my grandmother's house, I would not be the one I am today. For today's speech, I want to commemorate the sanctity of these meals at my grandmother's house, its effect on my life, and how my experience of these meals can relate to my audience's own experiences within their own family dynamics. From the beginning of centralized human society, family meals have been a central part of human existence. Humans would gather together for safety and of course, while gathering together for safety, would enjoy meals together. Now the family meal has coalesced into a routine, yet often to times a symbolic event. Family meals are a sign of sophistication and unity and together. The concept of family meal has passed down from generation to generation, and each subsequent generation.